You ever wonder, will the internet stop being the internet? Sometimes you got to ask that question. Like, will there be a moment in time where the internet won't be the internet and it will actually chill? And then you realize what's happened so far this year. At the beginning of the year, we was getting nothing but World War Three memes. And they were hilariously, deliciously funny. And that was a serious thing. Now, I don't think it was going to get to that level, but that was a serious conflict. And we were making light of it. That's the Internet. Someone posted a meme, which is ironic. I saw this a few months back. And it said, we have no chill. And the meme was a meteor basically heading towards Earth and obliterating us. And someone put the crying Jordan face meme on the Earth. And you know what's so funny about that? It's the fact that I could see a real scenario where the Earth is about to be obliterated. And someone will take time out of that very serious situation to make a meme out of it. And here we are today. The coronavirus is one of the biggest things being talked about all over the world. And we're about to check out the oh so delicious mm, spicy memes that the internet has provided us. Let's check it out. What's good with y'all? It's your boy Ross back at it again with another video, man. I wanted to do something different, man. Because... I've been seeing some crazy memes about the coronavirus, and I want to bring awareness to this thing that we call the internet. You guys need to understand, the internet is the undisputed, unchallenged champion of the world. It doesn't matter what's going on, it doesn't matter who it's affecting, the internet will internet no matter when, where, why, who, it doesn't, it doesn't matter, it has, no, it has no favorites, that's just what's going to happen. And honestly, sometimes it can be a great thing, especially in situations to lighten the mood. And then sometimes it can be a little bit, not even a little bit, a whole lot tasteless. But we're going to check it out. Now, once again, I know the coronavirus is very serious. You got several leagues shutting down or, you know, suspending uh, play of their uh, competitors you got the nba shutting down or suspending play uh the ncaa is, uh, has suspended play the xfl just finally suspended play um for all of uh us wrestling fans out there i'm not sure comment down below if you guys know but i do believe wrestlemania is in talks of being shut down as well so a lot of massive sporting events have been shut down to due to this and it's a serious thing but once again the internet gives no fucks so we're about to check out some spicy memes on twitter follow me on twitter if you haven't already just got back on there like maybe a few weeks ago what underscore now underscore ross man follow me on there send me some delicious ass memes i'm all for it like i said i know it's very serious all the uh, internet's going internet let's check it out man let's check it out I already have it loaded up just some photos right now media stay indoors and avoid public places to limit your risk of catching the coronavirus millennials two tickets to paradise that's actually true you want to know what's funny i actually know some people on my instagram that took advantage of the cheap flights and now are like in miami or somewhere else for the low low and it's funny, they got on the plane with the little surgical mask and gloves, but they don't give no fucks. They, they took advantage of flights, round trips being 90 something dollars. Can I blame them? Can't blame them. Me in the hospital with the coronavirus after flying a bunch of cheap flights. See? See? Facts. That's, that's the thing. Would I be doing it? Uh... Not right now because I'm I'm on this YouTube grind, so I'm very focused on this channel and the main channel. So I I wouldn't be doing it right now. But if I had the opportunity, I did talk to Dub. I was like, hey man, we may have to check one of these flights out, risk it for the biscuit. Um, scientists laughter can boost them in the uh, the immune system. The whole internet laughing at the coronavirus coronavirus meme. <laughs> I'm rocking with that. I'm rocking with that. <laughs> Ah, 
I like this one. I have the coronavirus. <laughs> now I'm black. I may need to use this on the cool. I may need to put a sign that says, yo, 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 nah, nah, I got the coronavirus. So I roll down this window. You gonna have it too. You know what I'm saying? Like I, I don't wanna I don't wanna mess up. You know what I'm saying Your livelihood So just let me off Just you know what I'm saying Go on about your day Let me Let me do my thing Don't You don't even have to Check my license registration Just Just go on officer I may have to use that man And knowing my black ass It still won't work He's resisting arrest Get away I have the coronavirus They'll come in there with hazmat suits And take me down Coronavirus Thank you for the memes Two week quarantine Me Work That's a real thing uh, jobs are starting to take this a little bit more serious and uh, people are actually uh, being told not to come back to work for a while. I know s some of the school districts down here in Houston, they're starting to uh, extend spring break, which makes sense because, you know, you don't want to infect everyone in your staff with the same virus. So until they get things kind of situated, uh, I think more public facilities will be uh shutting down so depending on where you work you may not be going to work for a while so we'll see i thought the coronavirus was just memes like world war three but i'm starting to get nervous <laughs> i was just talking about that at the beginning of the video we just had the world uh war three memes and now the internet is doing what it does best interneting uh let's see me and my mom have been sending each other coronavirus memes all day and she just sent me this i am deceased i got that pu <laughs> oh, i got that pure ale <laughs> 50 dollars a gram <laughs> text me <laughs> that's a good one i got the pure ale bro <laughs> hey text me man you know what i'm saying i got that pure ale on the low bro it's it's hot right now in the streets you know what i'm saying like it's flying off the shelf so if you you trying to you know what i'm saying keep your hands smooth you feel me i got you speaking of pure ale and hand sanitizers you know what i'm saying this is going hot on the streets right now you know what i'm saying mine's is colored so if you got some colored sanitizer word on the street is is even more powerful so you know what i'm saying i may have to you know i may 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 have to dish this out in the streets you know make some you know some extra money i'll probably charge it since it's like purple i'll probably charge it like a good like you know what i'm saying 150 a gram because like i said it's gonna be powerful it's gonna get rid of anything you got well not anything if you already got it hey i don't know what to tell you but shit you know what i'm saying moisturize your hands and stuff so yeah yeah y'all may want to get up on that bro may want to stock up on that uh let's see <laughs> <laughs> this nigga is driving with plastic all around him. <laughs> I like this one. I like this one, man. Uh, I like this one, bro. Me enjoying the coronavirus meme on Monday, but coughing and blowing my nose on Thursday. <laughs> oh, man. The meme I cannot seem to get out of my head. A lot of cheap flights right now. And part of me thinks if I'm going to get the coronavirus, might as well get it in a deeply discounted five-star hotel in, in Venice. Not bad. I think hotels are, are running low on like uh, charging people. Like they're, I don't think they're taxing as much. It, it's really starting to hit the economy pretty tough. So, hey, man, if you wanted to travel, you didn't have the funds. This is really the best time to travel, honestly. You just got to risk, you know, a virus. But, you know, eh, eh, who cares about a virus if you're standing on Eiffel Tower, you know what I'm saying? Or standing by the Eiffel Tower. Who gives a fuck? You feel me? I don't give a fuck. But I laughing about the coronavirus means when you, when you know your immune system is fueled by Starbucks coffee and cereal. I want to go to my Instagram because on my Instagram, I found some good ones that had me laughing all day. So if you're not following me on Instagram, follow me at Ross, the chosen one. Let me go to my story. These were these were great. Your Internet will always win no matter the situation. Bruh. Hold on. We got to go back. 
<laughs> the joy and crying face. The Jordan crying face, bro, on the NBA. You can't, like I said, can't go wrong with that. I go to Twitter because I have this on my Twitter as well. I got to bro, yo, this is ridiculous. Look at this. The CDC in association with FEMA <laughs> presents the coronavirus friday five dollar hand sanitizers five dollar lysol wipes no mask allowed i know it's not a real thing but that's fucking funny bro oh yeah corona fridays let's get it man five dollar hand sanitizers five dollar lysol wipes no mask allowed free before 11 o'clock make sure you get in you know what i'm saying get in where you fit in corona virus fridays let's get it sound effects sound effects explosion another one for you guys I found any ladies want to quarantine and chill i'm rocking with it bruh i'm rocking with it so y'all be safe out there we, we ain't doing no netflix and the chilling we're doing quarantine and the chilling because at, at some point boys ain't gonna really be probably able to like move around you know what i'm saying boys it's gonna be like on some you gotta stay in the crib type stuff you feel me so so if you got a special someone that you want to cuddle up with since nobody's gonna be able to go anywhere this is the perfect time to quarantine and chill i'm all for that movement all for it and i got one more little clip it's on my story on instagram i gotta go to it this shit was funny to me bro right here dude i gotta go to his page this <laughs> shout out to Darius DK, bro. He is hilarious on Instagram. Look at this. NBA basketball. 20. These niggas is hooping in hazmat suits. <laughs> These niggas is hooping in hazmat suits. And he pulled out the spray. I'm done. All right, I'm done. I'm ending the video off of that. These have no fucking chill. But that's why I said the internet will always be undefeated, bro. When it comes to just seriousness, the internet takes the seriousness away from it. That's just how it is. And you know what? Sometimes it's needed. You need some levity in situations like this because, uh, you know, people tend to panic. And that's the worst thing to do. You don't want people panicking out there. You want people to be aware of what's going on, but you don't want them to panic. And sometimes the Internet does things to make light of a situation to, you know, kind of just humanize us and, you know, let us you know have some type of laughter because we got to if we take this too serious to the point where you know people are afraid for their lives that could cause some problems because people under stress and fear they tend to act very irrational so i'm not saying don't take this seriously but i also am saying don't don't i guess put yourself in a situation where you're worrying so much because worrying that much to the point where you it starts affecting your life like physically emotionally and you know in a social space could be detrimental to you so that's why the internet will always be undefeated because it makes moments like this where you're able to laugh yes i know it's a very serious subject but at the same time you gotta be able to laugh sometimes you need to or we'll all go insane so shout out to the internet being the internet but hope y'all like this different style of video man uh i just like i said i want to try some new things on this channel uh wanted to expand my horizon on just on like other than just wrestling videos and uh best believe there will be some more story times on the way and uh some more wrestling vids as well on the way so but i appreciate y'all kicking with me i'll see y'all on the next one peace